Hi everybody, I'm back. And today I'm gonna to show you all how to make candied sweet potatoes. Here's what you will need. You will need two cans of sweet potatoes and those are 40 ounce cans, ground allspice, ground cinnamon. You will need syrup, one stick of butter, one and a half cups of brown sugar. Now the first thing that I like to do, let's go ahead and grab our butter and I've chopped it up, I've sliced it and we're just gonna throw a couple pads. Well, we're gonna throw all of this in here, just like so. All right? <clears throat> and then you wanna turn your oven on 350 degrees because when we cook this, it needs to be 350 degrees. And then I'll let you know the cooking time after this is all done. Let's go ahead and put us some cinnamon in there. Get you some cinnamon in there. All spice, ground all spice. If you don't like it, you don't have to use it. All right. If you're a person that likes nutmeg, use you some nutmeg. All right. <clears throat> you want to put you some syrup in. <clears throat> I need to open this up first. When I make candied sweet potatoes, I love to use syrup. <clears throat> and if I don't have syrup on hand, I will grab some honey. And honey will serve as the same purpose. All right, put your some in, guys. This is candied and it's meant to be sweet. You hear me? Trust me when I tell you this. These sweet potatoes, oh my goodness, you hear me? They are so good. All right, so then we have our half a cup of brown sugar. Put that in there just like so. All right, there's our cup. Put that in there also. And I want you all to be very gentle, okay, when you're stirring this. Because what we don't want to do, <clears throat> we don't want to break up these beautiful sweet potatoes. We want them to still be whole. So just use a rubber spatula, or if you want to use a spoon, that's fine. Just kind of uh, stir it in this folding motion so that you can be very gentle with the sweet potatoes. Now, a lot of you have the question... Like, Gina, my can says yams, right? It's okay, because right under it, sweet potatoes, right? Yams, sweet potatoes, whatever they call it, all right? It's just fine. Okay, now look at this syrup that we've developed from the brown sugar. See that? Let me see. The brown sugar and our syrup. Like I said, hey, if you don't have syrup, use your some honey. But this is the sauce you want. And make sure you use one full stick of butter. Absolutely. Now, there's one thing that I'd like to do. Let me grab some salt. Uh, let me see where my salt is, guys. Here it is. And I'm just going to put a little bit in. All right? Because the salt will bring out these beautiful flavors. All right, just a little bit. And this rest here, I'm gonna toss that. All right, <clears throat> mix this up well. If you wanted to, you can put um, vanilla in here. All right, give this a nice stir. And we will not cover this up. If you cover this up, what'll happen is this'll get runny. And we don't want that. We want this sauce to get nice and thick and bubbly. All right, let's throw this bad boy in the oven. And then during half of the cooking process, I'll let you all see in the oven so you can see what it's looking like. And then I'll let you know how long they cooked. Put your sweet potatoes in the oven on 350 degrees and I'll be right back. Okay, everyone, I wanted to show you what else is on my menu for tonight's dinner. What I've made is an oven roasted chicken, and when you split it down the back and you take the backbone out and you lay it flat, this is called spatchcock chicken. And so I've made that, that's done. And then over here on the side, I've made some macaroni. Just some macaroni and cheese. We're gonna have that with our sweet potatoes and then we're gonna call it a night, guys. Those sweet potatoes are in the oven on the middle shelf. All right. Look at that. Look at that bird. Isn't that beautiful? Be right back, everybody. 
Hey everybody, here's our sweet potatoes. I'm gonna let them go for about 15 more minutes. And now I've turned my heat up from 350 to 375. After 15 minutes, I'll be right back and I'll let you all know what this tastes like. Look at this, guys. Okay, everyone, I'm back. Now, these sweet potatoes have cooked for one hour. In the last 15 minutes, I turned it up to 375 just to get, you know, like the top nice and, I, I don't know if I want to use the word crispy. All right, now check this out, guys. Candied sweet potatoes 101. If you all have never tried this, hey, give it a try and try my recipe. <laughs> all right, so now what I've done, I've poured off just a little bit of that juice, all right? Now I'm going to go in and I'm going to give this a try. Oh my, I am so excited. You hear me? Now, possibilities are endless when you're making sweet potatoes. You could put pineapples in there. You could put um, mini marshmallows on the top the last five minutes in the oven. And that makes for beautiful sweet potatoes. But this right here, this is a traditional candy sweet potato. Now, and if you all prefer sweet potato casserole, check my sweet potato casserole video out. I have an awesome video for that and you guys will love it. Okay, let's go in. Hopefully I don't burn my mouth, but I am so excited for this. Oh my goodness. Okay, come on, guys. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Check it out, guys. Uh huh. Hey, I'm really cooking in this kitchen. You hear me? If you want some real food, you come to Gina's house or you follow my recipe and you can have the same thing. Look at this, guys. Candy Yams 101. Check it out, guys. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? Oh, all right. I need to let this cool down just for a second. I'll be right back. Okay, everyone, I'm digging in. I think it's nice and cool enough. Oh, so that I can enjoy this. Let's get that piece right there. See that cinnamon? Woo, that's beautiful. All right. And you all can taste this also. You know I'm going to give you that first bite. Taste that bite right there. Oh, and you can see, see how it is candied? Isn't that beautiful? Taste that right there. Let me know what you taste, what it tastes like. Oh, there you go, right there. All right, let me go in, guys. Mmm, mmm, mm-hmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Oh, wait. Mmm. Let me get, here's what I'm going to do. I know you all want to taste the sauce. And make sure, use a little bit of salt. And use that butter also, because that's flavor, guys. That salt and that butter. Ooh, -ay. look at this. Mmm. Oh, that sauce is delicious, guys. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, taste that right there. Oh, yeah, that's a good picture. Candy sweet potatoes. Woo! Mm-hmm. Make you want to smack somebody. You hear me? Mm, mm, mm. I'm so glad I made this for you all. There's so many of you all that has asked for this video. And I'm so proud to be able to make it for you so you that you can have this on your Thanksgiving dinner table this year. Mmm. 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 Mm -hmm. That little bit of salt makes a difference in that butter, guys. Trust me. Trust me when I tell you. Ooh. Mm-hmm. All you need is that hour on 350. Last 15 minutes. Bump that heat up on 375. If you've got too much juice in your thing, just pour some of your juice out when you take it out. Hey, no problem there, right? There you go. Mm. If you all enjoyed this recipe, mm, mm -mm. hey, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe and make sure you click on that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload one of these awesome videos. Mm -mm -mm. One, more, one more bite, guys. Mm. 
Look at that dripping. And as always, God bless. Have a great night. Thank you all for watching. Good night. Look at that, guys. Bite that right there. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. Good night.